Former President of Nigeria, Dr. Goodluck Jonathan, has once again stressed the need for all Nigerians, irrespective of tribe or religion, to put aside their differences and unite for the common good of the country. Jonathan came out with this in Yenogo at the Bayelsa State Capital when he reunited with his former classmates, pioneer students of the University of Port Harcourt River State, tagged the unique Uniport alumni. Our correspondent Jesse Essay tells us more. Here are members of the unique Uniport alumni who were admitted into the prestigious university in 1977 and graduated in 1981. It's been 40 years since graduation, and with visible happiness and smiles on their faces, the pioneer students relive memories from the old days in school. They graduated at a time when means of communication were limited, but from their various climbs, they broke limitations and rose to the peak of their careers. We are getting old, we are getting weak, we are getting sick. So whoever is sick among us, and we are aware of it, we contribute money or we take for a part of our money, we help such a person. We found it necessary for us to come in to Bayelsa and uh, Mr. President, who was one of us, we still one of us, graciously said, yeah, we should come in here. And I think everybody's excited about it. After over 40 years, you know, when we left school, there was no phone, no social media. So a lot of us have not seen each other until this moment. The alumni embark on a tour of some sites in the state, making a brief stop at the Oloibri oil well where crude oil was first discovered in commercial quantity in West Africa, the Nigerian oil and gas park in Emeyal, and then a visit to Professor Emeritus Ibigbiri Alagwa, one of the lecturers in Uniport. We were determined to do the best thing even to the point of giving ourselves a whole year to plan. And as I said, it's true, as from the day we opened, our university was on the top of the academic ladder in the country. For former President Goodluck Jonathan, the 2021 reunion is packed with great joy as he calls some Nigerians to emulate the oneness exhibited by the former students. He also lays emphasis on national unity. Human societies are organizing groups. You come from a nuclear family, you belong to a Lazar family, then you belong to a compound, you belong to a community, be it a village or town or whatever, you belong to a local government, belong to a state, you belong to a country. At every circle, people must unite. At the national level, we must see ourselves as one and unite to protect the interests of all of us who are Nigerians and push our in common interests. And where people are separated, they begin to think about their individual interests. Then, of course, the country will be in crisis. The four-day event ends with a lecture and an award to deserving personalities. Jesse A.C. Plus TV News, Yenogwa. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.